This total is called Total Bwai Sechikoni because it is on the road that takes to Makelele Chikoni but situated in Bwai Se. So around here, I'm going to be taking you down, to, down towards Bwai Se just to show you the mood in which we are as we gear up to enter into the new year. So remember to subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications and also share if you can so this is the famous market along here that market is known for fish you can clearly sit down there that is fish but i'm going to be taking this way down that road takes to kavule makerere kavule and where the nup offices are and a lot of other things even life Official life chart, something like that of Pastor Senyonga. So a lot of stuff here. I've already told you that these are locally grown here. Nothing is imported. The onions, the eggplants, a lot of other stuff. They're all locally grown right here. The oranges, the ginga. The cucumber, they're all grown right here. The plastic and those other stuff are also made here in Uganda. So I'm going to be crossing right here, go to the other part. Of course, it's kind of busy around here, but I had to. Someone also almost got knocked. So I've told you it's always, this market is always used clothes, phone jackets, uh, sh used shoes, that is second hand, everything. There are tomatoes, foodstuffs, and many other things. So remember to like the video subscribe to the channel second hand bras or used bras something like that and many others so we are going like this new clothes like andes so let's cross from right here that road takes up to the way, though, if I'm not mistaken. Irish, honey. Uganda has the world's best honey. According to some research, that Uganda has the best, according to the different tests. So, you could be out there thinking of which business to start. Beekeeping is one of those businesses that you can easily start and it doesn't need too much attention. The moment you attract the bees into, into the hive, the rest is history. So this way I am heading down in Hawaii. This road takes up to yeah, northern Uganda. They all go through Luwero and this is the one. This area is famous for a ghetto called Bwaise. Of course the area itself is Bwaise and it is a low-lying area. So that's why maybe the rich 
don't usually buy this way. It is those that have built structures. The structures are always here, but rented by people at lower prices because people don't usually rent them. So instead of being there for a very long time, they rent them at a lower price. And that way, all you should know, yeah, the areas are usually prone to floods. So you can clearly see also around here there is many people. I don't know why people had decreased on the Christmas day and now there are many. Those buses are coming from northern Uganda. That is Nile Star. To the city Kampala. This one's here watching screens. Here it's just crazy. It's just insane. Even with these traffic lights, border border guys still knock themselves because they don't have that patience. They want to cross when they are not supposed to. They want to go when they look at those ones. They want to go when they are not supposed to. The outcome is usually knocking souls down. So that is uh, around about this one's just put their shops on the wheelbarrows. That's why they sell t-shirts, shirts, t-shirts, and jeans as well on wheelbarrows. Someone called it Africa nasty. So I'm going to be ending here. I'm going to be ending around here and then continue to other areas. Bilari, Islamic schools, Waise is around here. Look at all these guys standing next to the road. They are all waiting for clients. So I'm going to be ending right here and then go to the other areas that I'll be bringing you guys. These ones are selling boiled or steamed corn. I want at this moment to cross the road and go to the other end. I don't know if it will be possible because everyone is coming at a higher speed. But first from around here, just like this. the other part up there that is the northern bypass 
around here in Wise eh? and there are still other people selling stuff around here. Sweets, the common ones is onions, tomatoes, vegetables that can easily that can easily be prepared and eaten. That's what most people do. They prepare that and then with some kosho or maize flour and then supper is done. It's been amazing if you've watched to this very end. Please remember to like the video subscribe to the channel turn on the notifications going towards one the gear via the Makerere Kavulil Road hopefully we'll be seeing the National Unity Platform offices as I'm going That is the home of National Unity Platform along Makere Lake Avule.
Before me, that is Centenary Bank, Mapera House, and this one is the new Pioneer Mall, and that's how it looks like. And, yep, Boda Boda guys have come back 